standing on the grounds of Royal Oaks in House of Hope in Omaha, Nebraska. And this is the site of my master's project that I'm completing for a master's in horticulture with an emphasis in gerontology. And the goal of my project is to create an approach and a methodology for uh, administrators, maintenance staff, and the owners and operators of senior living communities to use when working with people like me that want to design and install and manage the outdoor spaces in senior living communities. My approach is based on four different areas. So the first area is best practices in landscape design, install and management. The second area is the research and literature that's available in best practices for um, designing new, enhanced, and refurbished outdoor spaces in senior living. The third area is the benefits of nature on our health and well-being and the research involved in that area. And the fourth area is the research in the gerontology space on aging. So the goal, my goal is to synthesize these four areas and create a practical approach for the design, install, and management of outdoor spaces in senior living communities with the hope of benefiting the health and the well-being of the residents who live there. So currently I'm standing on the site of a space in the design for Royal Oaks and House of Hope that's called the park-like setting. And the goal of this area is exactly what it says. It's, it's intended to be a park. And the concept for this is a place where the residents can come sit under complete shade from an overstory tree canopy comfortably and relax amongst uh, their other residents, their friends, their families, their neighbors. And then also the staff can come and have a place where they can take a break, uh, eat their lunch and relax. So the design concept for this space is very simple. It's overstory trees, understory trees, and shrubs. And the goal is multi-season color. So beautiful spring flowering, diverse foliage, and beautiful fall color. The great thing about this space is the residents just have to come out the entryway and walk down a straight sidewalk, a very short walk to get into the space. But the other great thing about the space, which I noticed when I was doing the design, is it's very visible from inside the building. So right in the middle, you have a community room, and on each end of the building, you have resident corridors, and on each end of those, you have a lounge. And this space is very visible from there, too. So if we're, if we're focusing on the health and well-being of the residents and bringing nature in, when it's hot, it's rainy, it might be a little chilly, they can still go to those spaces and sit and look at the beautiful fall colors or the spring flowers. Or they can come out and enjoy the beautiful shade. It's all a wonderful thing.